Ukrainian forces have reportedly struck a fifth-generation Russian Sukhoi Su-57 fighter jet for the first time. This event took place at an air base inside Russia, according to Kyiv's GUR Defense Intelligence Agency, which released satellite images to confirm the strike. While the GUR did not specify the details of how or by which Ukrainian military unit the Su-57 was hit, a prominent Russian pro-war military blogger known as Fighter Bomber confirmed the strike, stating that the aircraft was hit by a drone. The jet was stationed at the Aktobinsk airfield, approximately 589 kilometers from the front lines in Ukraine. The GUR satellite images show that the Su-57 was intact on June 7th, but by June 8th, craters and fire damage spots were visible around the aircraft, indicating the strike. This marks a significant moment in the ongoing conflict, which began in February 2022, with both sides frequently launching strikes deep into enemy territory using missiles and drones. Ukraine has been focusing on developing long-range drones to compensate for its smaller missile arsenal compared to Russia. Fighter Bomber reported that the Su-57 was damaged by shrapnel and is currently undergoing assessment to determine if it can be repaired. If deemed beyond repair, this would be the first combat loss of a Su-57. Russian state-run news agency Araya Novosti's military correspondent, Alexander Karchenko, posted a message highlighting the lack of hangars to protect military aircraft, indirectly acknowledging the vulnerability of the jets. The Su-57, touted as a fifth-generation fighter aircraft designed to rival U.S. equivalents, has faced numerous development challenges, including a crash in 2019. Its serial production only began in 2022. This heavy fighter jet is capable of performing a variety of battlefield roles, making its potential loss a notable setback for Russian military capabilities.